In 2015, astronomy was revolutionised when an experiment called LIGO discovered gravitational waves. We have here pieces of the technology developed for that experiment, which we're getting ready to have on display at the Science Museum. Albert Einstein first predicted gravitational waves back in 1916 through pure mathematics, but he doubted we'd ever find them. A hundred years on, it took the world's most sensitive experiment ever constructed, which this object was developed for, to finally detect the first gravitational wave from Earth. LIGO is an international collaboration based in the US. This is a prototype for the beam splitter, which sat at the heart of the experiment. Its purpose, as the name suggests, was to split the laser beam. The laser, after being split, goes down two whopping four kilometre long concrete tunnels before returning to its origin, where it recombines. At this point, scientists look for the very slightest changes in the length of the two laser beams, which would indicate the presence of a passing gravitational wave. The level of accuracy needed is mind-blowing, equivalent to measuring the distance between the Moon and the Earth for less than a diameter of an atom. The actual signal detected by LIGO in September 2015 originated from two colliding black holes, which were 1.3 billion years away. So when the signal finally got to Earth, it was incredibly weak, and you needed that level of sensitivity to actually detect it. LIGO's discovery of gravitational waves was awarded 2017 Nobel Prize in Physics, and it's already begun to revolutionise astronomy. Astronomers can use gravitational waves as a tool to probe the more mysterious aspects of the universe, such as black holes, neutron stars, and perhaps in the future, even the early stages of the Big Bang. One of the early fruits of gravitational wave astronomy is uncovering the secret of where gold came from, and we now know that gold was forged in the collisions of neutron stars. Who knows what future things LIGO might uncover?